वेलकम बैक स्टूडेंट्स माई टूडेज टॉपिक इज कंपेयरिंग डॉक्यूमेंट्स फर्स्टली गोइंग थ्रू द डेफिनेशन वेन शेयरिंग वर्कशीट रिव्यूर्स मे फॉर गेट टू रिकॉर्ड द चेंजेस दे मेक वॉट इट मीन्स एज अर्लियर आई जस्ट टोल्ड यू अबाउट मर्जिंग वर्कशीट द प्रीवियस टूटोरियल दैट टाइम आई हैव टोल्ड यू दैट रिकॉर्ड ऑप्शन शुड बी ऑन सो इफ यू नॉट गॉन थ्रू माई प्रीवियस टूटोरियल प्लीज गो थ्रू द प्रीवियस टूटोरियल आई प्रोवाइड द लिंक एट द बॉटम there i have told you that if you want to share your worksheet data with many reviewers just to update the data and then afterwards you want to see what updations they have done then merging worksheet option was very beneficial but there one condition was there that you have to on record changes option now but somehow if reviewers or persons who are doing the changes they have forgotten to record the changes then what they should do just if this kind of problem occurs then there is one option in calc as written in definition calc can find the changes by comparing worksheets so there is one more option in calc it can compare two worksheets and then the difference can be seen means comparison between worksheets can be done in order to compare worksheets you need to have the original worksheet and the one that is edited so that means the one which is edited that worksheet is needed and the original worksheet so now directly i'll take you to the main worksheet now in desktop i had made one folder there i had saved one of my file which i have used in my previous tutorial also naming it as main spreadsheet Now in this file, I have already off the record option. I'll just open this file. So here, I'll just check it. I'll just put some data, and you could see the red border is not coming. That means that record option is off. From here, you know very well the record option changes record. So this is already off. So I'll not on it. And what I'll do. i'll make the duplicate of this file how to make the duplicate of this file i'll open the folder and then with the help of control key i'll drag it and we'll make a new duplicate sheet and rename it as one so this is the copy now now what i'll do i'll close the main file and then i'll open the duplicate file from the folder i'll open it now i'll try to do changes in the data here suppose instead of 80 i'll type 90 instead of 60 suppose 99 three four changes i'll do and in between suppose i want to delete the row i have deleted and instead of triple a i'll make it as z z z and then i'll save the file so i've already pressed control s so it saved now suppose i'm closing this file now i have two files suppose this is one of my main file main spreadsheet file i'll open it and my another file is different which i may have given to other user or reviewer who has done the changes and sent me back so i can show you both the files so you could see here two files now here in two files you could see here i have done the changes now this is my duplicate file and i have done the changes and this is my original file so now how to track the changes with comparing documents option so i'll move ahead with this file only what i'll do i'll go to edit changes and at the 
bottom of changes you could see here compare document so i select this option this one this option now this dialog box comes and directly it's opening the folder where i have saved the main file so i had made this folder on desktop so i'll just click it i'll click it here because both the files are located in the same folder as i had copied the file in the same folder only so it's easy for me to compare so i'll click on main spreadsheet file because this is my main file i'll click on open and now you could see red lines so firstly row inserted i can see the change here row inserted i can accept or delete so if i click on accept that means i want to accept the change suppose i want to reject and then row deleted i want to reject then content is changed cell a4 change from triple c to triple z so moreover it, it's working like merging document as we have done in my last tutorial so the same way we have to accept or reject we can click on accept all also suppose this one cell c4 change from triple c to triple z so this i don't want i want to reject it and then afterwards accept all and hence we can use this method named as comparing documents method to update the changes done by the reviewers i hope this method is also very much clear to you you are always welcome to comment at the bottom and if my tutorial is helping you in any way please click on like option so now i'm closing my tutorial we'll be back with a new tutorial so till then bye bye